how cute they are. Aloni is talking with Carly. <laughs> hey guys, it's Brenda from my Read Read Blooms channel. I'm here with Elodie and Carly. Elodie is my Ashton Drake child doll. She is the, um, <laughs> she's cute. She is the, uh, I think Lana ballerina doll. I know she's a ballerina. Um, I have her looking so sweet in her um, bunny hat and this is Ace um, outfit from Pat Pat while well, the shirt the pants are oh, <laughs> the pants are from Rebecca's and um, and the shirt is too so I think I put her in there before and I also have Carly and Carly is the Gabriella sculpt by Reva Schick and she is my big if I can grab her <laughs> she is a reborn child doll um I'll find out how tall she is she is a big girl she is definitely a big girl and her hands are like <laughs> but I came here to show you some um, differences and similarities between the Ashton Drake, which are a lot less inexpensive, and the Reborn Child. Um, I should have brought Rebecca because she is about the same size as Alana, which is the Ashton Drake masterpiece doll. <laughs> Um, I get a few comments when I, with Elodie here, and I love how she can, like, pose and stay that way. So that's different. The Reborns, they can't, they're just <laughs> floppy. Unless you have the kind that could stand, and Carly isn't. She, well, what I should do is just turn the camera around. After I get them comfortable. Now, let's see. See, Elodie here, the Ashen Drake, is complete vinyl. Like, she is full body vinyl. She has joints in her knees, which she could swivel and bend. Like bend down and bend up, and they can swivel. And her legs also is a little tighter because, like, I haven't moved her a lot, but I'm sure over time she would be more. And LOD also has like the joint in her elbow, which could make like. See if you can see that her elbow could bend. And also her arm could move like up here on her shoulder. So, and she's falling. But yeah, she is complete, like hard everywhere. Now, Carly the reborn she is a typical reborn her arm is staying up like this for now but she does not bend in the elbow only at the arm it can go in and up and she has a cloth like actually all of this is cloth up to, like her knee and down so like she could move her le her knees and she is a lot more flexible because 
she's got hair on <laughs> because she's a reborn so yeah all of this is like um cloth and up here is cloth and she has like a chest plate so from about here and up is like 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 a belly plate kind of and she has in her back this is like cloth up to here and then she has so she can wear like like uh, my words are not coming but Carly wait I would say that Carly is a bit like obviously more realistic than the Ashton Drakes oh <sighs> Um, I also get a lot of comments like, where did I buy Carly? I got her from a Canadian artist, Lucy Gerard, and she is in Quebec, but she knows English. And she has, she's on Facebook and she has a website and she does have a couple of child reborn dolls for sale like right now. <clears throat> but oh <laughs> she's heavy <laughs> and, and anyways I want to show okay I'm completely and this one I bought from eBay and also Canadian uh, Ashton Drake distributor she's also in Quebec I'm not sure of her name but I do know her store name so her eyes they like somebody was saying like i heard that they have red eyes or purple eyes um it depends on what, how the light is hitting them they are a bit purplish like right now i don't know what they look like like they are they're like a brown but in certain lighting she does look now i want to um excuse me there um, I do want to point out reasons why I love both. Uh, the Ashton Drakes are obviously a lot less expensive. Um, Lucy's, I love her work. I love it. I love her work wonderful, and her prices are actually pretty reasonable. Um, let's see if I can show you up close um like i love how lucy does like the modeling and um her painting um i do notice that her finger is turning like look how realistic Let's see if you can now for for these it would really depend on how well the artist could paint now i'm not sure if carly wore rings like she might have wore rings before from because i bought her second hand so i do love how realistic the reborn children are and carly is one of the bigger like probably um like one of the sculpts biggest sculpts she is definitely the size of a five-year-old um even a six-year-old she is definitely kindergarten size and lod the masterpiece um i find that her head does not really match like if she was a realistic size she's not a realistic size she is definitely doll-like like her body is is a nice size but her head is small like if that makes sense um carly is definitely realistic with proportion led is not um but i do love posing led like she can pose and stay that way which is cool like i could do my stop motion videos 
and I'll move closer. I wanted to show you how her painting is in her hands. If you can see. So the Ashton Drakes, uh, they do come, like, you know, with the fingernail tips, and they're slightly painted. Um, she has no real veining or anything. I'll show you her feet. Which, like, you can tell it's a lot more, and it's completely hard. Like, I can't even squish it. And those are her... She has nail tips and a bit of paint. And I'll show you Kylie's feet, which are a lot more realistic. Those are her. But then again, with Reborns, it's up to how the artist can paint them. Um, but I must say that her feet... See if I can show you the bottom. Zoom out again. Her feet are big. Her feet are definitely like, is that blurry? Sorry about that. Her feet are painted a lot more realistic. This is how the side looks. So, yeah, if you didn't know any better, you'd think that was a real foot. So, and Reborns have, like, more realistic, um, like, structure here. Like, it looks like a real calf, real ankle bone. And I love Carly. I love her a lot. There's her other foot, which is huge. <laughs> But I love Carly. I love her so much. Oh my goodness, she's my big girl. Now, money-wise, as for the price of the Ashton Drake, I do personally think that I do think that the price was worth having the masterpiece doll. I mean, she is dollish, and I think she's cute doll. I love how she could hold a pose and I love I she's hard to dress <laughs> she's really hard to like she's not realistic this way at all but for the reborn I do love Carly a lot because she is realistic I can dress her a lot easier especially with the legs being like this but <clears throat> oh totally didn't see that especially with her legs like being so movable because the cloth I can feel that there's a wire in here too I can feel maybe I keep this shape here her knee shape but anyways guys I'm just rambling I'm so sorry I hope to be on here a lot more the thing is like the sun has not been shining. <laughs> so cold here too. <laughs> but I've been relaxing. I've been uh, getting all prepared for Christmas. And that is done now. So hopefully I can just laze around the house and do some videos. The boys are not here now. They're at my ex-husband's. So I'll have the house to myself freely to be able to speak my mind with you guys so thank you so much for joining me guys and until next time very soon i'm just wrapping bye guys love you match hand guys match it match hand guys love you until next time bye guys <laughs>